What up, everybody? I'm the host of Difficult People Chronicles, the podcast. I'm seriously focused, Johnny SF Johnny. I'm back at you with another message. You know, life is hard. We all know life is hard. Some of us have drama. Some of us have one bad day after the next bad day. Some of us is going through a spiritual warfare. I know. And we grew up on the saying, pray about your enemies. You hear from church members, you hear from family members, you hear from friends, pray about your enemies. And if you were like me, at one time I prayed about my enemies. And I felt like the fire was turned up a notch where I was ready to throw in the towel. It's like I felt like I was about to break down. But what I knew at that time was if I give up, it's either me or them. It's either life or death. And I chose life. So I had to keep fighting. And I kept praying about my enemies, praying about my enemies. And then it was just like, it was just so much that one day I said, I need to do something different. So I went to God in prayer and I asked God, what do I need to do? Because I said, God, you said that vengeance is mine. I will repay. So all I could do was pray, you know, and leave it up to God. And God came to me that night and said, pray about the enemies known and unknown. And then once I did that, it was smooth sailing. But that doesn't mean that I stopped praying. No, because what I realized was this. A lot of times... We see it in the news. We see it on social media. We hear about it through through the grapevine where a person's friend is right in front of them and they flip. A lot of times, friends and enemies are starting to look alike. I'm going to say it again. A lot of times, friends and enemies is starting to look alike. And you got to be real careful because... That same person that's right beside you sitting at the table eating, the same person taking the flight with you going from point A to point B, is the same person that when you're winning, they standing behind you with a smirk and side-eyeing you because they really don't want to see you win. And because they that close, they know your every move. And because they that close, it's easy for them to attack you. And that's why they plotting, planning, and scheming. And you're feeling like <laughs> you can't get a break. You got to pray about your known and unknown enemies. Because once I did that, God started showing me the enemies that was up close. Yep. Sitting right at the table with me. And don't get it twisted. A lot of people in this world say things like, oh, you're going to need that person or don't burn bridges. Sometimes, you know what God will give you? He will put you on the flight that you fly straight over that bridge and watch that bridge burn. And when you're on that flight, you meet other people. That person ain't supposed to be with you. That enemy is not supposed to be with you. Pray about your known and your unknown enemies to know more schedule a session go to my website seriouslyfocusedjohnny.com and i have a downloadable document out now it's called your money matters get your copy schedule a one-on-one session go to my email sfj.peace at gmail.com and hit me up with some questions or a topic you want me to talk about all the links is underneath So it's about that time. It's that end of the year. Win a 30-minute free session. Email me at sfj.peace at gmail.com. Put in the subject box, freebie. And I wish y'all good luck. Have a blessed one. Love me more, and I love you more. Later.